evening. I should be more professional. I should introduce these every week. Maybe I'll start doing that. Um, this is a DSC live draw once again. Welcome. Welcome, new, old, everyone. Um, hop into the new... There's a new DJ plug room. Uh, you should hop in there. Listen to whatever we've got going on. We've got some Thundercat playing right now. Some nice slow jams for you. It's actually not a slow jam. All right, I'm working on a weird drawing right now. For a secret, very secret project. Yeah, metaphorical rap oracle. It was migrated. My bad. Um, let me let me change the link. The link. The it is simply DSC now. Plug DJ slash DSC. All right. Yeah, sorry for you guys in the other room. Maybe I should go. In. Yeah, guys, go in. Go into the DSC room. Make sure that's clear. Make sure that the guys don't think that. Um. Go ahead and tell them about the new room. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. All right. Let's let's start working on this. God damn! I got bumped out. Cool thing about the, these types of drawings is it'll probably be done by the end of the hour. That was actually an old logo I made. I was just trying out different colors and stuff. Ab Zero, what's up, what's up, what's up? TJ Henry. Uh, there are no bitches here. I forgot, I forgot all of them. Oh, where the hell? Oh, there we go, there we go. Did you guys watch Sailor Moon as you when you were kids? And did you were you aware that it was for girls? And did did you even care? Now that I think I think back, uh, that was my first anime experience. I was hooked. For when I was a kid, I would watch that before I went to kindergarten. Uh, at pretty much every morning when it was really early, it was like six or seven. Uh, it was. I don't know. I liked it a lot. My favorite Sailor Scout was uh, Sailor um, uh, Mercury. Because she was white. Because she was white, dog. Yeah, the smart one. Alright, anyway. Anyway, anyway. If you play some anime music in the in the in the plug room, I'll be very happy. I got some of my favorite anime tracks coming up. So don't click meh or I'll kill you. Oh yeah, what happened to Skeeter? That weird fella. 
metaphorical. Oh, <laughs> Ab Zero said, I watch Sailor Moon religiously, dude. Japanese dog wants to be referred to as Little Dick Rab right now. M Shay said, I used to kiss my TV when Sailor Moon came on. <laughs> By the way, you guys, if you live near anywhere near New York, go to Littlefield in Brooklyn next, uh, I forgot when it, October 9th. Yes, I believe it's October 9th. Um, I'll be there. D Respect is going to be there. Fantano's going to be there. Uh, come say hi. Do it. Powerpuff, Powerpuff Girls is good too. Hey yo, what up? It's your boy Young Tuna Fish Casserole, aka the Human Stool Sample, aka Rap Game George Costanza, aka the word discomfort personified. There weren't any gay characters in Sailor Moon. I think there might have been a lesbian or two. Well, I don't know. If I was gay, I'd watch Sailor Moon every day, son. As opposed to every week. <laughs> oh my god, this is this shitty drawing. What's going on, Andre Sanchez? Daniel Creator. Hey, hey, hey. Thanks for uh, liking all that shit on Tumblr, dude. Holy shit, Lil B just followed me on Twitter. <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> that is pretty, that's pretty wild. He just followed me, but I think he follows everyone. This dude follows 907,000 people. I'm tweeting right now. This is a live tweet, fellas. Lil B just followed me, but I don't know if I should feel special. He follows everyone. Like, if he followed 900 people, that'd be pretty impressive. Abby Maddox, I'm doing good, man. Look, stop spreading those nudes, man. I told you not to spit, send those anymore. Yeah, I have a Tumblr. It's cblackula.tumblr.com. Uh, Straight up cblackula. I put GIFs there and stuff. Excuse me. Pardon me, pardon me, pardon me. Pardon me. If you fools aren't following me on Twitter, you should do it right now. Abzero says, so my fucking e-copy on Super Smash Bros. will only download 2% at a time. That's because everyone's doing it, man. That bandwidth. This Tom York track, I like this shit. 
I like that. I like that. This guy's kawaii enough. <laughs> I'm gonna give this guy Yu-Gi-Oh here. Or Goku here. This is how I used to draw in, uh... I used to draw like this in 6th grade actually, I remember exactly how I used to draw like, like little anime guys, I, I would draw like eyes like this, and the hair would go like that. <sighs> TJ, uh, me and Hal Rudnick are doing the dance right now. Um, the thing about interviewing people, at least in my experience, is like if you can't get them, if you can't get them to agree on a time, the first, the first time, after the first time you initially pitch a time, if they can't make that, it, the the, it's weird. It's like the chances of them coming on just decreases. But he's been tweeting me. We've been DMing like, oh, when is this gonna happen? Like, is this time good for you? Is that time? So it's gonna happen. I just gonna be, I gotta be patient. Um, Felix Colgrave, um, let me, let me just bring up his drawing so that I can, so that you guys can look at something. Um, Felix Colgrave, when I was interviewing him, this dude, it took me, it took me a year to get him on the show. I, you know, cause he, he, he lives in Australia, um, huge, like 14 hour time zone difference. The guy's fucking busy as shit making his animations, making stuff for Cartoon Network. Um, so, yeah, that was rough. It, it was, yeah, it was just very slow. It was like once once every two, three months, I'd just email him, like, oh, yeah, you free this time, you free that time, blah, blah, blah. Draw Childish Gambino as a Muppet. I like that idea. All right, let me do that. I didn't like Stone Mountain, man. Ab Zero, I've never read 20th Century Boy here, that's good. I've, I've read Gaunt's Incredible. Amazing shit, man. Like, the despair, the shitty situation that they're in, I, I, that's what I love. That's what I was so drawn to, like, how pointless it all seemed. Because it was, it was, you know what it was? It, it wasn't just the fact that it was pointless, it was difficult. Like, that world, that's one of the most toughest worlds I've seen as far as, like, and they give you the tools to fight. It, it, it's not like, it's not like Walking Dead where you, where, or something where they're not that powerful. Like, you don't have that much power against the enemy. In, um, in Gaunt's, man, like, I guess for those of you who don't know about this, don't know about the manga, it's about like these people who um, they're forced to play in this in this weird. They, they all die, and it's like this weird afterlife where they're living amongst humans, but they're like they're allowed to live except they have to play this weird game every night where they fight these aliens, and the aliens increase. They get incredibly strong every time. Main characters die. Um, just, the odds are so against them. Uh, a lot of dying, a lot of crazy shit. Let me find a quick, quick image of Gantz. Oh man, and the crazy, this shit had the craziest boss fights, man. The craziest boss. Yuck. This shit. 
Oh my god. Look at that. Dude fucking decapitated on the floor. Like, this is the team. They will go, like, every other night or something. They will fight bosses. Fighting guys that are like this. Huge monstrosities. It's like it's like the worst video game you ever played. Like the most difficult game you ever played, except you, you actually die in real life if you die in the game. Yeah, dude. Uh Felix Colgrave, he he's fucking he's amazing, man. Japanese dog says I wanna fuck Pam from Martin so bad, bro. Destroy a cunt. What's going on, Paranoid Mage? Where's my Felix Colgrave? Oh, did I... Oh, I fucking closed it. I had that Muppet in there too, dude. Did I lose it? Fuck, I was drawing that Muppet. Fuck, fuck, fuck. My bad. Whoever uh, requested a Muppet, now I don't have the energy to finish it. Yeah, you really can't explain the plot without sounding nuts. Marco Harara, what's up? Dude, this new Java speed is so good, man. Um, I, I don't have a 3DS, so I'm not playing it. Bad boy, you can suck shit too. Welcome. <laughs> Andre says, Dom, I don't know if you remember, because I haven't been on here in like a year, but I asked you to draw a pirate, and then you drew one, and that was pretty cool. Thanks, man. <laughs> All right. <laughs> Simple enough request. I, I don't remember drawing a pirate. I don't remember anything. Like whenever I'm talking to a girl, I don't remember her birthday. I don't remember when when her parents, uh, anything about her. I don't remember where she works. But girls kind of like that. They don't want you to remember everything. You remember that dick, though. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> All right, so. Oh man, so appalled. Yes. It's like that sometimes, it's shit ridiculous. Be sometimes. Yeah, I, uh, bad boy, I listened to Stone Mountain, didn't like it. Didn't like it that much. Like that shit, like bitch, I'm bitch, I'm taking cars, no small talk, yuck. I didn't like it, man. It was, it just, I mean, I liked, I guess, like the southern hos hospitality freestyle was okay. Champagne wishes, dirty white bitches. I mean, this shit is fucking ridiculous. This ugly six pack. Marco Herrera. Has a date this weekend. Nice. Nice. Where'd you meet her? What does she look like? Does she smell nice? Yeah, TJ. It'll happen eventually. I, I don't know when, but I'll, I'll be tracking them down, man. 
My favorite Kanye song is um it changes, man. But right now probably like I'm in it. Right now it's it's probably I'm in it because I wanna use it for um dude, I have a crazy I have this crazy idea for a hip hop RPG, um a big pretty big boss fight where where Kanye is um so this is Kanye right here and he's sort of I mean, this is sort of a dramatization of what the fight would look like. He's sort of, he's he's falling through the air, right? His, his cape is billowing in the air. And he, he, it's just him against this one boss. And they're in a free fall. And um, Kanye's trying to summon summon creatures and beat this guy before before he hits the ground. Or just figure out a way to sort of not, not die. But yeah, I'm in it would be playing in the background. That's something I really wanna um I really wanna animate. Oh Marco met a girl on Tinder. Andres, I right now I play um a little bit of Destiny and um some shitty pinball game on Xbox One. And I play, um, yeah, that's about it, man. I don't, I don't have enough time for games because I do shit like this. I, I, it's too much. It's very demanding. I can tell you what I want to play is um, Alien Isolation I want to play. But there's something on my wish list. I want to play uh, The Vanishing of Ethan Carter. If any of you gift this game to me, I will I will do a let's play immediately. Uh, my screen name is Dolomite One Five Seven, or it might be it might be Count Blackula. You can add me on Steam if you like. If you like, Marco, you're scared. Shut up. How old are you? First, tell me, tell me how old you are, then I'll give you good advice. Japanese dog asked, what was high school like for me and everyone in the comments? Um, I was just a nerd. I was a pretty, pretty huge nerd. Um, not, not socially awkward, just kind of like always reading books and stuff like that. Um, didn't know how to talk to girls at all. I was still religious at that time. Um, what else? I mean, I, I was a lot fatter too. I was like, I was like 40, 50 pounds heavier. So I mean, like definitely no, no play from girls, no confidence really. I mean, I, I was sort of confident, but n not at it, it, girls at all. Like I didn't know what the fuck I was doing, but that's common. You know, I didn't really like high school, uh, but that's a, that's a good sign, I think, for the rest of your life. If you didn't like high school, you're probably going to do fine for the rest of your life. Abzero saw Saihai the Prince in a small concert. He wore nothing but leather, and it was really bad. People were walking out of the show. <laughs> what? I have Xbox One. I think my Xbox One name is C. Blackula. What's going on, random player? What's up, Miyagi? I don't know anything about the Lil Wayne Pusha T beef. Go ask the respect about that stuff. Metaphorical said, I showed this girl a hip hop RPG and she liked it. Nice. If, if, Anything that I do gets you laid, then I will feel like I accomplished something in this planet. Oh, dude, Marco, you're 20. Get the fuck out. You're not a you're not a virgin, are you? Listen, man, you're gonna have to learn this the hard way. But 
um, it's it's okay to be nervous, but when it when it comes down to it, uh, she's she doesn't want to see that. I mean, unless she's really into like wimpy wimpy sort of s- sad guys, um, you're just gonna have to jump into it, which you're gonna do anyway. You're gonna do fine, but you gotta um. The best thing you can do to build your confidence is to have more success with women. So just keep on, keep on hanging out with them. Have have as much sex as possible while, obviously not, not um, not worrying only about your your pleasure or whatever. Like you gotta you gotta figure out what you're doing, and like pay attention to shit. Don't just be going out there like, like trying to just come and and, and leave or whatever. You gotta figure out what you're doing. Some serious advice today. Jeez. Don't be like, dear respect. Uh, I come a lot. I come a lot. Yeah, so basically, your, your focus is experience right now. And don't, don't fall in love with the first girl who gives you attention and, like, end up marrying her or some shit. Don't do that. Whoa, whoa, whoa. All right, all right, all right. I, I it in sixty nine. Okay, he says eat some apples before the date. It gives you plus ten confidence. My favorite Christmas song is Winter Wonderland. Yeah, you guys might as well post your Twitter handles so you can follow each other. Random player says, question, I'm DJing at a friend's Halloween party. Should I play Death Grips? If so- No, don't. Look, do you want girls to like you or not? You're at that age. You gotta play, play popular shit. Stick with, I mean, you, you, play some fucking um, Mad Lib songs, dude. Don't, don't play Death Grips. Damn it. You gotta get those girls, man. You gotta get the girls. Oh, wow. Who played this Naruto music? God damn. This takes me back. Fuck. Dude, I haven't heard this shit in years, man. Wind. It would be you, Ab Zero. It would be you. God damn. Cultivate your own good for you, idealize. Damn. Never coming down. Dude, this song is like, this is uh, ninth, tenth grade of high school for me. And this is awesome because, um, it's sort of, it's sort of, um, I think encapsulates what what made the series good for me it's like some sad sad weird orphan kids um who like they have they have potential in life but um yeah they're basically fighting to 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 see how like where they're going to end up as adults or whatever but they like it was it was all potential you knew that uh, the adults were much stronger after the tuning exams uh naruto got really fucked up wasn't any good. She put in shitty. Shit put in. Oh, man. 
Naruto had some good tracks in it, man. Japanese dog, I follow you, right? Okay, yeah, I follow you. Don't listen to Japanese dog. Don't tell her any. Don't don't compliment her on that shit. Don't tell her shit that every guy is telling her. You gotta stand out, my friend. You must stand out or be forgotten. Oh man, that was one of the best anime endings. You will hate yourself in the end. All right, F Zero, I got I got one for you. When you hear this shit, you're you're gonna you're gonna go crazy when you hear this shit, man. I want to abuse my room privileges and just go right to the top of the queue, but I won't do that. I'm gonna set up my own dating network. It's gonna be all dudes. Like, where the girls at? I don't know, homie. Don't cry. Why, why would you make out with her instantly? Why would you do that? You gotta build up to it, man. You can't just jump into that shit. What are you, crazy? What are you, nuts? You gotta ease into it. You gotta you gotta ease in. You gotta build up. Let it build up like a like a dirty clogged pipe. Um I girls don't like jerks. I mean I mean they do, but it's not it's not you have to stop thinking about it that way. It's just, it's, it's stuff like jerks have certain things like confidence. They have, they have, they have confidence and there's some other things. That's the biggest thing, actually. They just happen to have all these other qualities that are shitty. Like they, you know, they use other people to make themselves feel better. That, that kind of shit. That's, you can, you can do all this stuff for a girl that jerks do without without actually being a shitty person. Mostly by being confident. The rest of this shit, I mean, you're going to figure out on your own however your style is or whatever it is you do well that girls like. You just do more of that. Also, um, uh, you got to get good at something. Do And, and not, not for the purpose of getting girls. Like, if you draw... Learn how to draw really well. If you can, if you make music, learn how to do it really well. Not to, in order to get girls, but girls are going to show up and you're going to get them because you're really into something. Because most people don't do anything. So, like, if you have a skill, um, that's going to help. Help you in life. You know what I'm saying?
Oh, this is Crystal Castles. Why isn't she singing? I didn't fall asleep. I, I was uh, a friend just texted me. <laughs> Miyagi says, "Yo, I've been waiting an hour for my pizza. I hope it never comes. <laughs> I just hope you're waiting for that pizza forever." I'll love what? There's so many messages right now. What the fuck? Don't buy Call of Duty just because Kevin Spacey's in it. Dude, I love Mentos, man. Do you respect that I grew up on that shit? Mean mugger! Mean mugger! Everybody mean muggers here. Put your dicks away. Alright, I'm gonna draw a quick mean mugger. <laughs> mean mugger! Yeah, you're popular amongst this crowd. Get out of here. Yeah, Ab Zero. Fully, fully Cooly is one of the best, I think, man. So good. So good, man. So good. So good. Every basketball hoop needs a pole on the bottom connecting it. Hopefully that makes sense. In the image. Ah, reflector. Very good. Very good. Good live draw. Good live draw. By the way, guys. Um, next week, no live draw. I'll be in New York, in Littlefield, Brooklyn, hanging out with Anthony Fantano and Dear Respect. Um, come hang out with us if you're in New York or anywhere near there. Um, I'll be in I'll be in Brooklyn for that weekend, uh, doing a few a few shows with Dear Respect, maybe maybe two podcasts, and um, going around museums. I'm gonna be talking to a lot of girls too. If I see a girl in the street that looks good. I'm just going to walk up to her with as much confidence as possible and see if I can make something happen. I expect to get shot down a lot, but if I if I succeed, I'll be talking to Dear Respect about it. Live on the show. Yeah, Fooly Cooly is weird. Metaphorical says, how much did D make from selling our details to Google after all, all posted them in the comments in the last podcast? They actually didn't Post them in the comments. They they emailed them to me, but yeah, we made uh, seven dollars. It 
If you guys want to play Smash Brothers, give Marco your buddy code or whatever the fuck. Why would you... You guys are fucking weird. Right. What, you want some gifts? Is that is that what you want? Hmm? Is that what you little fucks want? Some gifts? Huh? Okay. Make this a little smaller. <laughs> what if I can add a little snowman hat to me, right? Very quick. Real fast. Damn. See, I want to download a Santa hat for my mini cam. Oh, shit. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> you guys are gonna like this one. Hopefully this doesn't crash everything. Alright, let's see if this works. I think it's working. Uh-oh. Okay, there we go, there. Okay. Now, now. Let's see if this works. <laughs> Retarded. No. Why isn't it? It's because I'm fucking black. I just want this Kakashi headband, but it's not not working. Man, fuck this shit. Ugh. Horrible. Horrible, I say. Why? Why did I even bother? Or maybe this will work. Jesus, camera. I swear it's probably because I'm black. Alright, here we go. Alright, swag. Look at that. <laughs> oh, hey, what's going on? I heard tell you doing okay. the chat look at all these all these shitty effects oh man they have spooky effects too. oh shit
Daniel Creator says, if I didn't know better, I would think Dom is insane. You'd be right. <laughs> okay, yeah, let, let's let's get back into this shit. You guys threw me off. Making me put Naruto's on this shit. Fuck y'all. Oh. Wait, wait, wait. Custom. Yeah, there we go. Let's take that Naruto out. Whoa, spooky. Did I spook you guys? Sorry. Wow, this is a throwback song, man. <laughs> this song. How do we sleep? <laughs> Dom's head is DLC and alien isolation. <laughs> Yo, this episode's too spooky, man. <sighs> okay. Yanis Krachs. Oh, maybe there's a Sasuke on here. Oh, that'll be cool. Maybe a Rock Lee. Eh, there's no Rock Lee. It's probably a Sasuke. Oh, shit, they have Sharingan on here. Nice, nice. Shitty anime effects. Spooky. You guys spooked? Okay, let's turn that off. Alright, work time. I'm working. Quit throwing me off, guys. Gotta get shit done. I'm on deadlines right now. Mmm... Dun, What is JoJo's Bizarre Adventure? Is that a cartoon? <laughs> I'm spooked. Fuck this. <laughs> mean Mugga spooked. Sorry I spooked you guys so bad. I was hoping to find a spooky skeleton uh, thing. But... 
whoever finds me the spookiest skeleton gif, I will I will show it on the screen. That's the rules. Find me a spooky skeleton, please. It better spook me too. It better be, it better be all spooked out. Why is this not? Ah, right, there we go. There we go. Oh, nice. <laughs> I shouldn't be driving this car. <laughs> I shouldn't be driving this car. I shouldn't be driving this car. Yo. <laughs> I shouldn't be driving this car. <laughs> Oh no! I shouldn't be driving this car! JoJo's Bizarre Adventure is a weird anime. I don't really see the draw, but it is fairly popular. I ain't watching that shit. Yes, a gif of Madonna dancing does count. Tweet it to me. You can uh, you can send it to me on Twitter if you don't want to post the link in here. Go go into all that trouble. Oh no! I shouldn't be driving this car. Shouldn't be driving this car. This is the ugh, weird fucking song. I shouldn't be driving this car. <laughs> My roommate's gonna walk by and be like, what the fuck? Every Friday night he does this. He sits there and talks to himself. Why? I don't get it. I just don't get that dumb fella. It's too weird. I better go back to masturbating in my room alone. I shouldn't be driving this car. Oh no! I shouldn't be driving this car. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I, I gotta stop. It's just too catchy. Oh Lord in heaven! Whoa! It's a pretty spooky gift right there, man. <laughs> Oh, young parakeet, what's up, man? I didn't even see you. Oh no! We're five minutes away from the ending, from the Ebola takeover. I don't know any. None of you asked ask me my opinion on this Ebola thing, but um, I. I, I hope it doesn't get to be really bad, but I, I have to admit, a part of me is sort of like imagining these post-apocalyptic scenarios. What's up, Bill Hicks? Oh no. Random player that doesn't make you a racist. Aren't you 12? 
That makes you racist for being 12. Oh no. You can date whoever you want, okay? Don't let anyone keep you down. Who the fuck is Lucas Aid? Yeah, and Bill Hicks, yes, this is Anthony Fantano. Yeah, did Sam Pepper really rape that girl or something? Or, like what what's going on with that? This is good now. Every episode has an average average max viewership of like 22 or something. Nice, nice. This is some zombie music, man. God damn, this is the music you hear before you get eaten up by 20 monsters.
Average max viewership. TJ Henry says, some people are mad about Sam Pepper's vids. And this one feminist YouTuber got a petition to get YouTube to get Sam Pepper to stop with the way he's treating women in his videos. That is never going to happen. They're actors. It's not even fucking real. It's 10 o'clock? Oh, fuck me. God damn it. <laughs> Shit, I'm so bad at this. All right, you guys. <laughs> Thanks a lot for coming around. Uh, like I said, no live draw next week. Um, look in the comment section. Imminent evening with Anthony Fantano next week. If you're in New York, come out to that shit. Thanks for coming by as usual. Um, I did not like Stone Mountain. I really didn't like Stone Mountain. Enjoy your anime. Don't be scared of women. Be nice to them. But also be firm and confident. Enjoy yourself. <laughs>